Merry Meet, and welcome to Rusted Log Cabin Life. I'm your host, Big T. Yeah, that's me. And today we'll be making a peanut butter cake with peanut mocha icing. Well, I've never had a peanut butter cake before, so I'm excited to see how this turns out. Well, let's get to it, shall we? One third cup peanut butter. One cup white cane sugar. Two fresh eggs. One cup milk. One teaspoon vanilla extract. Two cups all purpose flour with one tablespoon of cornstarch to make cake flour. One tablespoon or four teaspoons baking powder. A quarter teaspoon salt or about this much. Something about like that. Is that salt? Yep, yeah, that's salt. Uh -huh. About that much. Yeah, maybe a little bit more. There you go. Sift dry ingredients with pork. Here we go. Go, go, mix it all up. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I don't have a sifter, so this is the way we're going to do it. Next, we're going to add the flour and dry ingredients mix here. There we go. And we want to mix it all together. Next, we want to prepare our pan. This is an 8x8x2 eight by eight by inch baking pan. So we need to grease it. I use some uh, canola oil spray. Next, we're going to pour our batter into the prepared pan. Oh, yeah, it's pretty thick. This is a real thick batter here. Next, we're going to set the oven to 350 and let preheat for 10 minutes. Next, we put the cake in the oven for 30 minutes on 350. Oven is preheated. Here we go. Nice out. Next, we're going to boil some water on the stove to make the mocha part. I use a French press. Next, we're going to prepare our French press to make the mocha. So, uh, we get one, two, three. The recipe calls for three tablespoons of hot, strong coffee. About this much peanut butter. Oops, <laughs> get in there, get it. Oh. Work, 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 work. Next, we add the hot water to the French press. Whatever's not used in the recipe, 
I'll drink it myself. Then we stir the grounds in the French press. Get it all thoroughly stirred up. Add the top. Wait five minutes and it'll be ready to pour. Next, calls for a half teaspoon of vanilla. So I'd say about that much. Yeah, maybe a little more. There you go. So we're going to press it now. And it says uh, three tablespoons, huh? Where's my tablespoon at? There it is right there. Three. Three tablespoons, hot, strong coffee. And a little dab. About that much. Next, we had two cups powdered sugar or confectioner sugar as they like to call it now we turn on the mixer hope it works I had to add another cup of powdered sugar so this is three cups of powdered sugar three tablespoons and a smidge of hot strong coffee and a half teaspoon of vanilla and it's supposed to be one tablespoon peanut butter but I think I put a little bit more so it was too thin add an extra cup of powdered sugar and presto it works okay now time's up so we're gonna pull this sucker out gotta get my oven mitts first so I don't burn my hands Ooh, yeah now that looks like a cake there okay first we gotta test it with the knife make sure it comes out clean and it does Wow. Okay. So now we wait for about an hour till it cools and then we get a frost it. Next, we're going to frost the cake. So let's try and frost it here. This is some really thick frosting here. Ooh, I don't know if that worked. Okay. Some really thick frosting. Look how thick that stuff is. Wow. Yeah, no, that's some really thick frosting. I think I made it too thick. Yeah, no, that's some thick stuff, all right. That's for sure. Well, here we have it, peanut butter cake with peanut butter mocha icing. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. 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 That's good stuff. Mmm-hmm. Interesting. Well, there you have it. Peanut butter cake with peanut mocha icing. Until next time, this is Big T. And uh, I'll catch you all next time. Catch you later.